back in Ann Orlando. We're surrounded by those painter guys, but they don't seem to see us yet. So, hmm. I'm not exactly sure what to do because I believe if I use a homeward bone, it'll take me right back into the painting and then I'll have to run all the way back to the boss. So I think my only option here is to just run. So let's see if I can pull it off. Uh, you can't catch me. You can't catch me. Nope. I'm going to zigzag. There's nothing you can do. No one counters the zigzag. The slalom. Around the pillars. Oh, I get some more stamina. Don't throw knives. That's cheating, dude. That's cheating. Okay. Where do we gotta go? We gotta go... I guess this is fine. We'll go all the way down. And there should be the bonfire right there. I believe. Yeah, that's right. That's right. We got this. So, that was the painted world. I'm sure I missed a couple of things. There's like another ring down with the bone wheel knights, but is it really worth it? Is it worth dying like a million times and turning this whole thing into like a week of worth of the painted world? No, it's not. So we're finally sitting down and we're just going to we're just going to hang out here and we're going to love the bonfire. We love this bonfire, don't we? Yeah. So now, I believe the next order of business is we got a warp, and we're going to go to the location where we're already at, but uh, one bonfire up, I believe, at the one at the very start, and we're going to go, oh, you're still here. You got anything cool to say now that I've beaten your buddies? Hmm. So you have received a revelation. You can say that. Very auspicious. I hope for the best. Yeah, I, I talked to a big lady. Her wish will be granted. Oh yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do her wish. Oh. I guess I probably should have done that this whole time. Can I do it again? Nope. Have you heard of Seath the Scaleless? Yep. In legend, he turned against the ancient dragons. He became Lord Gwyn's confidant, was granted dukedom, and was allowed to pursue his research. Yeah. The regal archives. He immersed himself in research on scales of immortality. The one thing that he did not have. But his very research drove him mad. Imagine that. Became a, dungeon. a dragon reading books now, in a library. Approach the Duke's forbidden archives. It looms over this land high atop the mountain. But well, I should warn against even an approach. It's funny you should say that. Because that is exactly where we're going to go. We're going to go find that seath the scale is up in his duke's tower which looks amazing from here i must say i do love that little touch of like here's the place that you're going to okay so we're so behind us is where we came in all the way back from the iron golem and then there's the elevator down to the pillar drop way and there's where we fought Pikachu and Snorlax and down there is the cathedral that had the painted world so it's all connected in this awesome way and is there anything oh there's chests I want those chests hey give me those chests you know you want to just come over here just enough Oh, what was that delayed? Come on. Just come over here just enough for me to go ahead and run around. That one on the right is obviously a mimic. You can tell by the coloring. So I'm going to grab this one and then automatically die. All right. Roll, roll, roll. All right. Let's well, I'll come back for the mimic one. How about that? Okay? Because I don't like dealing with these giant people. They're too too much. They're too much. And they apparently can't do normal human sized stairs. So we're pretty much all good from this point. 
and up here if you remember this well I've never actually shown it but this was one of the crazy force field doors that opened up when we finally what did we do we killed some boss was it when we opened up the Lord vessel thing I believe with uh, what's his name there oh come on oh I missed the butt shot I missed the butt shot should I run? I should probably run. Yes, let's run. Let's, uh, uh. I want to get the butt shot in. I know, uh, if I can just, if I can just have a moment of your time, Mr. Boar. Have you heard? Uh, come on. Oh, he's got me. He's got me in a corner. Ooh, Dukes, he's gonna charge. Yep. Okay, I'm down to four, four Estes. I can keep playing with him, or I should run like I probably should. But for some reason, I continue to provoke him, which is, you know, what happens. I, how am I not getting the, uh, the backstab? I must be off by something. This is horrible. Come on, come on, come on. That's not it. Oh. Well, that, that teaches me a lesson, huh? Time for a quick run back. You know, it's gotta be said, I'm really admiring how the hollowing process seems to make our body match our uh, head texture. It's really aesthetically pleasing. It's gotta be said. So anyways, we're back with Mr. Boar. And as much as I would like to kill him for his hat, because I don't think I've gotten his hat yet. But I can't remember. Not that it's useful or anything, but one of these days I will get his hat. But because he's been giving me problems, it, it's time just to run through. And, uh, yep. Should probably hit this real quick before they murderize me. But they should be able to go back into their little hallway, and then I'll go hit the bonfire. But now we are in a new zone and we're going back down because bonfire, we need it. We definitely need it. It's not worth that whole run back that we just did. Okay, there they go. One of them's kind of glitched out. So maybe we will have to kill these guys. Nope, they seem to be going. Well, that one's going to get caught up now. Are we going to have to fight them both now? That's not going to be fun. Okay, he's backing up. He's backing up. Oh, he's engaged. He's engaged. Come on. Come on. We got both of them now. That's not good. This is not going to end well, I don't think. Yeah, this is not going to end very well. Especially with one coming up the stairway and uh, getting within range can you turn around please you're not supposed to be up here and you know it why can't I get the backstab I'm just failing maybe if I tried it two hand maybe uh oh one of them's still mad no they're both still mad but this one is glitched Oh, kick to the face. Oh, we gotta get in. We gotta get in. So long as we're in, we're safe. Oh. Just 
Come on, give me the backstab. I want the backstab. Or I'll just kill you normal. That's fine. Oh, oh, oh. Calm down, Missy. What do you want? Nope. Oh, we're gonna... Oh, I thought we were gonna eat one. But it's fine. It's fine. If we kill this guy... Then we can hit the bonfire and these two will never bother us again. There we go. Yeah, that's right. I taught you a lesson. Oh, we got the helm! That I'm never gonna be able to use because of my egg sack. But... Regardless, we gotta check it out. We gotta check out all the helms. Where are we at here? Okay, boar helm. Uh, severed head of the fully armored fang boar, taken by the one who killed it as proof of his victory. Just as the gods once did with the head of the ancient dragon. Can be worn on the head as a surprisingly sound piece of protective gear. Well, they say that. It doesn't give too much protection. It's heavy and doesn't, I don't, like I said, doesn't do amazingly well. But, important news is we're at the bonfire. We can't kindle because we're hollow. But we do have a humanity point we could use if we wanted. But, I think it's more important to uh, take care of the uh, front side of things. Oh, maybe I should have used some souls to level up or go back to the blacksmith and get items. I don't know. Oh, man. This is taking me back already. Many a run back I've had from this place. This is basically the, uh, the Duke's archive that once her name was talking about. And it's just filled with these crystal crap heads that want nothing more than to ruin your day. They just ruin your day. And they're made of crystal, so they're super tough. Well, not super, super tough, but tougher than your average hollow. Let's say that. Um, okay, so we just gotta deal with Mr. Archer over here. I say that as m magic immediately comes, as well as Mr. Dude from the right. That's fine. It's nothing we haven't dealt with. It's the old misdirection. It's like, hey, look at this one dude. And then from the right and the left, you got two more. Oh, nice dodge. Nice dodge, dude. Ooh, I thought we were going to walk into a stab there. But nope, we're good. Now we got big crystal guy that we fought down with the hydras. Oh, I forgot about that one. Like a crazy AoE effect. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Because I gotta... Nope. What? I thought there was supposed to be a thing there. Oh, no, no, no. I'm gonna have to go back. Okay. Or I just totally screwed it up completely. Basically, this is the guy that you kill for the item that gets you into the DLC area. Oh look, you guys remember this guy? All the way back from the undead bird. Oh, he teleported. That's his gimmick now. He just teleports whenever he, you uh, damage him. He runs behind his line and is like, oh, come get me, boy. Ooh. Alright, time for rolls. Gotta get back down behind the pillar. And I'm out of Estus. Great. Great, great, great. I do not see this run going too well in the immediate future. Ooh, that was a bad whiff. That one wasn't. Okay. Oh, snap. Snap, 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 snap. We can't take much more damage. We got the salt. That's great. Can we backstab? No, we can't. But 
We can stagger kill. Oh boy, he's got a buddy. He's got a buddy. I see you. Trying to flank me. I see you, baby. Shaking that ass. There we go. Two shots. That's not too bad. Crystal straight sword. Let's check that out real quick. Crystal straight sword. Uh, fully crystallized straight sword. Uh, such a weapon was created is entirely unknown. The crystallization boosts its attack, but makes the blade brittle. So basically, boosted attack, but you have to repair it like, I don't know, three times as much or something ridiculous like that. Something crazy. Something crazy. Okay, so we've cleared out the bottom floor, which is a shame because we are now out of the Healy Juice, and I just know that up ahead isn't exactly going to be fun. Let's see, what do we got? We got this way with another ladder. This thing shouldn't work. Okay, it does work. Well, call me a liar. I guess we're going right back up again. Oh man, I'm starting to get lost already. Oh, no I'm not. No I'm not. I know where we are. This is, uh, that's a thing. That's a thing we'll deal with in a hot second. But, but first, there's other things uh, to attend to. We'll get to that when we're good and ready, darn it. First, we want to go back here and die with 11,000 souls on us. Because that's more important. No. No, actually. You know what? I think this is a good point to take a break from the camera and go spend these souls on something useful. And we'll Alright guys, I'm back. I am no, I know I'm not in the same place I used to be. I came back down to where the Hydra used to be and now this guy has spawned. The DLC guy. I forgot he only respawns after the... Oh, I got real lucky on that one. Only after the Hydra is killed. And just like that, he was keeping a lady prisoner inside of his body. How weird is that? So, it is thou who rescueth me. Most gracious, I am deeply obliged. I hear I that echo. It's like she's talking telepathically or something. I it's weird. I stay here for long. So, before I disappear... Allow me to ask one thing. My home, Ulysseal, is the home of ancient sorceries. My hope is to pass this profound knowledge to thee with thine approval. Would this be of assistance to thee? Yeah, I'll uh, listen to what you have to say. My heartfelt thanks. I am pleased beyond words. Then I shout, engrave my signature if thou art in need. Pray summon me for ah. So she's going to become a fun buddy. May the great flames guide thee. Thank you. Bye. So that was the DLC lady. And that's all we needed. And uh, we'll see you when we're back in the Duke's lair. Doodly 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 doodly. Doodly 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 do. Okay. So now that we're back in the Duke's lair... I had to show that to you guys because I believe now that I've killed that person or the crystal guy and saved the very nice lady that this crystal guy up here will actually do what I expected him to do in the first place. Which is a good thing. It's always a good thing when they do what they uh, what's expected of them. Oh come on, don't block it guy. Don't block it on me. Oh, and his buddy comes in for the assist. Great shot. There. How do you... Oh, I was about to ask how he likes the jumping attacks. Apparently, he likes them just fine. He likes them with mustard and ketchup. Okay, so Archer, Magic Eye, crazy dude to the right. That's what we got to remember. Okay, dude to the right. Yep. Ooh, that was ugly. Come on, put your shield down. Come on, how many of these... How many are you guys? 
You just keep on coming. Just keep multiplying like friggin' rabbits. But you guys aren't rabbits, you're undead crystal crazies. Okay. So, back to the crystal guy. Hopefully, now, he will drop. Oh, if we can kill him. There we go. Yes! Yes! That's what we needed. We'll take out this guy real quick. And then we'll be able to read the description. In peace. I hope. Anyway. There's still that sorcerer out there going absolutely nuts. But, uh... Hopefully he'll stay where he is. Is it in here? Which one is it? Yep. Broken stone pendant. Deeply enchanted. Uh, powerful magic can be sensed from this ancient stone. Yet men of this time can neither manipulate manipulate nor sense its power which has a distinct air consisting of both re re reverence yeah reverence and nostalgia very weirdly worded but hey now we got the now we got the dlc item guys we can go check out the dlc if we want should we do that no not yet